I got it mounted. Uh, it's a bearing that I'm going to use, the housing I'm going to use uh, to rotate the barrel on, which come from a, a mowing machine. I cut the uh, universal off and welded that on. a couple angles across here. I'll, I'll weld this up better but I want to, before I go crazy with it, I want to make sure everything's going to work the way I want it. This seems to be centered. Fairly decent. I mean, I don't know. It's kind of hard to figure out what exactly. I, got, I know the center. It's in the center but, you know, is it perfectly plumb? you know both ways this way and this way that's hard to do as I found out especially with a crooked drum but the only way to know is when I put it on and start spinning the things find out that's one of the reasons I want it to spin as slow as possible just in case it is off a little bit it won't hurt it but we'll see. That's just the old setup from the mowing machine. Um, there's a couple bearings, heavy duty bearings in there. And um, I just welded that onto a piece of it. I beam down to the other that I had left. Seems more solid. It's not really supporting anything right now because of the, I have the wheels still hooked. I don't know. I have to see how that runs with the wheels on. Just the extra support right now. It's been a couple weeks since I've worked on this. Now all I have to do is figure out how to hook the motor up, which I'm having my second doubts about that half horsepower, but I'll have to see. And I still got some patching on this drum to do. I'm gonna finish this up. And also put mixing blades in there. So I got the uh, one pulley set up, which should be enough to gear it down. I didn't figure it out, but I run it a little bit. And it seems slow enough. Could be a little bit slower, but I'm gonna leave it go with that. The only way I could maybe make it a little slower is bigger pulleys than I have and I don't think I'm going to come across that I'm going to give this a try and see 